Hello, I am Dr. Jitin, Consultant Nephrologist at VPS Lakeshore Hospital. Today I am going to talk to you on the topic Chronic Kidney Disease. As you all know, kidneys perform the vital function of removing the excess waste from my body as well as removal of excess fluid from our body. The chronic kidney disease is characterized by gradual loss of kidney function which may occur over a period of months to years. As a result, there is accumulation of waste products and build up of excess fluid in the body and the patient may become symptomatic. The condition if diagnosed early can be prevented and the progression of disease can be delayed to a certain extent. People with chronic kidney disease are at increased risk of stroke as well as coronary heart disease. What is the commonest cause of chronic kidney disease? The most common cause of chronic kidney disease is type 2 diabetes mellitus. In fact, 1 in 3 patients with diabetes mellitus have some form of chronic kidney disease. Other common causes include hypertension, genetic causes like polycystic kidney disease, glomerular nephritis, drugs, toxins and excess use of painkillers as well as urinary stones. What are the symptoms of chronic kidney disease? Unfortunately, most of the people with chronic kidney disease do not manifest any symptoms of kidney disease at the early stages of the disease. It is said that more than 80% of kidney function may be lost before the patient becomes symptomatic. Some of the telltale symptoms which may give clue to the diagnosis of chronic kidney disease include early morning nausea, vomiting, muscle cramps, itching all over the body, swelling of the face, swelling of the feet, passing more urine at night, etc. 